Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here. Happy Monday. I trust and I hope that you had a great weekend. I know I did. I spent the weekend at VidCon Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And then there was an unofficial Disney day through VidCon that I spent yesterday at California Adventure and Disneyland. And say hello to this guy right here, carved in the side of this piece, this chunk of wood. You can actually check out my VidCon video from VidCon over on the Adam the Woo channel. I uploaded it super late last night on YouTube slash Adam the Woo, my first channel. This is my second channel, Daily Blog channel. It's the Daily Woo. Two channels, free to subscribe, and I really hope that you have subscribed to both. That way you can stay informed either on the adventure edited videos on the Adam the Woo channel or these unedited vlog, a vlog I have done well past 1,000 days in a row. So I want to show you something very interesting. I'm out here at Knott's Berry Farm. There are roller coasters aplenty, and there are also little areas of Western civilization that are built out here. It's almost like two theme parks in one. I love Knott's Berry Farm, and I've been here in the past. I've showed off some of the coasters, and I've showed off some of the ghost town, but I want to show something that's almost between ghost town and the coasters themselves. I'm talking about this, the fantastic house made of, that's right, made of this, bottles. Shunk -a -gunk -a -gunk 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 -gunk. It's the bottle house. And the reason it's called the bottle house is for a very good reason. It is made out of legit glass bottles and then in between the bottles which make up the wall regions of this home slash house they have actually put some sort of adobe say that with me now adobe just like in peewee's big adventure now i'm going to start incorporating something else into my vlogs i'm going to start incorporating a homework ex assignment or a homework excitement if that's the thing that gets you excited if homework gets you excited then this is the vlog for you because I would like you to do some Columbo like research and figure out exactly what year the bottle house was created here at Knott's Berry Farm in Buena Park California and what else is the bottle house made out of other than bottles now as you can see bottles take up and probably accumulate a very good percentage of the walls. Oh, and we are at Knott's Berry Farm, but do you see that up there? Do you see that right there? Now that's supposed to be a three-leaf clover, I'm guessing. But for the sake of theme parkedness, we could almost say that there is a hidden Mickey, hidden Mickey, hidden Mickey at Knott's Berry Farm. Weird. Strange and bizarre. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, so the bottle house. Right around here is the bottle house. Now, like I was saying, do some homework assignments of your own. I cannot get over these, what these look to be like hidden Mickeys. Now, they are not hidden Mickeys, but I'm actually drawn away from the bottles up to what looks like our hidden Mickeys. So here is your homework assignment. What exactly is this made out of? These, as you can see, are bottles. But next to it is some sort of stucco. I was saying adobe, but I might be incorrect in assuming that this is adobe. Basically, they put the bottles in and then they fill it in with some sort of concrete type of aspect of some sort. So if you know, definitely leave some comments down below. We will have a conversation throughout the day about what this house is made out of. So this is the Bottle House, Knott's Berry Farm. It is Monday, T-G-I-M, here from Knott's Berry Farm. And inside there is a little gift shop, and I will go inside momentarily and actually show you the inside and actually show you the other end of the bottles, not the rear end that we are seeing from here, not the end that the bottle stands up on, but the nozzle end that you pour the beverage and the wine and whatever else is inside these bottles. So this is the bottom end and the top ends are actually inside there, the bottle house. Looks like up top we have like a, a wasp nest or a mud dauber up there. I don't know what that is, or it's some sort of a bat-like creation where bats 
hang out at night. Maybe the bats are getting getting a little drunk off the bottles. Who knows? All right, let's go inside. Let me show you the what the bottles actually look like. Look at this. So look at this. This is the other end of the bottles. You could actually you could actually drink off these. Like you could actually get a little a little in there. These are actual bottles all along the wall. And here's a better look at the wall of bottles. And it's kind of cool how the sun shines through these and actually like comes towards us. Look at that. That is awesome. So there you have it. The Bottle House, Knott's Berry Farm. Use your skills when it comes to Googling and researching things on the interwebs and leave some comments like I was saying. I would love to. I, it's always been very interactive here on the Daily Woo, this unedited vlog, a vlog I do every single day. But I would like to step up the interactedness by you guys leaving comments about what you have learned, what you know. I do not know everything. In fact, when you do something every single day, you learn something in return for sharing things. That's what this circle of goodness is all about. Me sharing my experiences, you're share, you sharing your experiences and your knowledge back with me. So together, we are partners on this wonderful thing called the internet. There's a lot of negativity on the internet, but I assure you, there is way more positivity and good things on the internet. Like us, together in this relationship, this circle of goodness of things that I like to present to you and things that you like to share with me through the beauty of comments, through the beauty of social media, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, all those I am on there as well as Periscope. I will see you guys later. Please check down below for my t-shirts. There's a link right down below this video. AdamTheWoo.Spreadshirt.com. You can get this exact shirt or about five or 10 or maybe even 15 other designs that are my designs, just like the Hecate shirt. Any size, any color. You can actually take this green color and turn it into a purple or a pink or a blue, any color you want. They are totally 100% customizable when it comes to sizes, shapes, and colors. And I've also added children's sizes, women's styles, as well as some new designs. So add them to woo.spreadshirt.com, and I will see you guys tomorrow. I love you guys. Goodbye.